Some birds build nests not just as cradles for their eggs and chicks, but as lodging houses for the whole year. Here in Namibia, in southern Africa, lives the sociable weaver, and very sociable it is too. As many as three or four hundred birds will live in a single apartment block. This haystack may be more than a century old. It's so heavy that part of it has broken the branch that supported it and fallen to the ground. And it's been built and maintained as a communal effort by all the inhabitants. Weavers are closely related to sparrows. Though some of their relations do indeed weave, the sociable weaver builds in a rather simple way. It just pushes straws one by one into this gigantic bale. A large communal apartment block has a considerable advantage over small isolated nests when you live in a desert like this. During the day it gets ferociously hot but that thick roof of thatch keeps the apartments beneath nice and cool. As the sun sets the weavers having been away feeding come back to their homes. At night, it can get very cold in the desert, as much as seven or eight degrees below freezing. And then the thatch is probably at its most valuable, because it acts as insulation for the nest chambers, so that they retain much of the heat that they had during the day, and the birds that roost inside remain snug and warm. Not all the chambers are for nesting. Some are not nurseries, but bedrooms, in which several of the colony snuggle together for warmth. 